I've been working with West Lindsay District Council businesses for the past 12 months. I've worked with some amazing businesses offering, offering them social media support. And these are my top three tips for using social media in your business in 2024. As a business owner, you need to make sure that you have access to all your social media accounts. You need to make sure that you've got your usernames and passwords to all of your accounts. Even if it's not you that's doing your social media, maybe you've outsourced it to a member of your team, maybe you've outsourced it to a social media manager, but as the business owner, it's so important that you can access them at any time. For your Facebook account, you need to have at least two admins on there. You need to be one of them. If another member of staff has access and then they leave the company, you need to make sure that they are removed from the account and you add somebody else on. This removes the risk of you losing access to all your accounts because the member of the members of your team are no longer working for you. Change your passwords at least every 90 days and make sure that you've got two factor two factor authentication switched on on all your accounts. Meta Facebook and Instagram will never send you a message on Messenger to say that they are shutting down your account. We are seeing a huge increase on people getting their accounts hacked, spam messages being sent and people being really unsure if these messages are valid. So Meta, Facebook, Instagram, they will only ever email you. If you get a message to your Messenger account or in your DMs on Instagram claiming to be from these organisations, just delete it. Don't click on any links. Don't forward the message, don't pass over your credit card details, just delete the message as soon as possible. If you read the message and you're unclear if it's a spam message or not, the easiest ways to check are these three ways. The from email address will not be meta, it'll be, some, from, it'll be from something like Outlook or Google or Hotmail. Also, the grammar and the spelling will not be correct and they won't have addressed you in the correct manner. Social media is such a great place to run your business, but it is very busy. There is so many platforms that you can choose to run your business on. But unfortunately, it's no longer a great strategy just to post a couple of times a week, post a couple of photos and hope for the best. You really need to be able to be consistent with your content and all your content needs to be in alignment with your marketing goals. The best way to do this is to ask an expert. Get an expert in to help you develop a really strong content and social media strategy so that it's easy for you, it's easy for your team to implement and that is the easiest way that you're going to be able to attract your ideal customers to your business.